The UC Santa Cruz Campus Natural Reserve is a 400-acre education, research, and habitat reserve located on the main UC Santa Cruz campus. The campus lands are an incredible resource for students and teaching classes. They have really similar color to the new. Students from a wide variety of disciplines can walk steps from their classrooms out into the forests, grasslands, and chaparral of the campus reserve. Within five minutes, I can take my class right out of the classroom and be out collecting data on natural ecosystems. I know. <laughs> For many of these students, it's their first time really looking closely at nature and discovering the complexity that surrounds them every day. I am the crew leader for the FERP, which is the Forest Ecology Research Plot. I hike up here every single Friday and we'll go to a plot and measure the diameter at breast height as well as any new stems that are growing on the FERP. FERP is part of an international network called Forest Geo of about 65 mapped forest plots all over the world where we all study trees in exactly the same way so we can compare our data to look at how forests change over time. The campus is a fantastic place to show students the physical traces of histories. We have evidence of industrial logging in the 19th century, cattle grazing, and students can learn to see the physical traces of these processes. This is a uniquely valuable space to inspire them with the value of respecting landscape. After college, I hope to go to grad school, studying in the field of climate and energy. I hope to work with incoming students of color and introducing them to their diverse conservation efforts. This opportunity that I've had at the FERP has allowed me to build the skills that I need in order to reach that goal one day. The UC Santa Cruz Campus Natural Reserve makes this campus absolutely unique. Here we get an opportunity to study ecology not just out of a textbook. We get to go out and see it, touch it, experience it, to make those theories in the textbook come alive with our own experiments. And that's really powerful.